Hello there, I'm James Kempton and I'm speaking to you from the Institute of Advanced Study in Princeton, New Jersey. Behind me you can see a lake that has become very familiar through the film Oppenheimer. It's just over there that Albert Einstein and Robert Oppenheimer are depicted discussing the atom bomb and nuclear war. Now I'm staying at the IS at the moment while I attend New York Climate Week, a week-long series of events that discusses another the great threats to humanity, climate change, and biodiversity loss. I'm attending New York Climate Week to speak about Expedition Cyclops, an SES-supported expedition that I led last year to the Cyclops Mountains of Indonesian New Guinea. And on that expedition, my team and I rediscovered Attenborough's Longbeat Echidna, named after the legendary Sir David Attenborough, a bizarre egg-laying mammal that hadn't been seen for 62 years and was feared to be extinct. We also discovered a host of new species to science and we conducted fundamental research into the ecology and evolutionary biology of the fauna of those mountains. I tried to bring to New York Climate Week a sense of optimism because these discoveries that we made were truly optimistic. I wanted to counter the feeling of doom and gloom that can often attend these types of conference. I talked about the way that New Guinea is a haven for biodiversity and how we need to work with the local communities that live there to find a sustainable way to protect this extraordinary place. So please join me on 29th of October at 7pm at the Hollywood Arms in Chelsea to hear more about New Guinea, about the Cyclops Mountains, about Attenborough's Long Beat Echidna and about my future research plans. Get your tickets on Eventbrite and I'll see you there.